One of my favorite things about owning a bigger camera, a cinema camera, is the ability to rig out your camera system. Being able to add on components and really change the way your camera system works for you and depending on what shoot you're doing is still one of the biggest advantages of owning a cinema camera. Some of you guys may know that I've been shooting on a Canon C70 for the past few months and I finally got my rig to a point where I'm really, really happy with the system. I'm using it on a bunch of shoots. All of my professional videography work is done with this camera and I've had a few people ask if I would share my rig setup uh, with you guys so that's what I'm going to do in this video I'm going to strip this camera right down to the bare bones and build this camera rig system up if anyone's been following my journey with cinema cameras on this channel you'll know that I've been back and forward between like the Blackmagic pocket cinema cameras uh, the Canon C70 I used the Canon C200 for a little while and I've landed on the C70 I absolutely love this camera one of the main reasons is its battery life is fantastic it's got very good autofocus it's more monitor and screen are pretty good, the built-in ones. The main things that I actually wanted to tackle with this rig video uh, is not things like battery life, the biggest thing is stability. Adding extra additional but also functional weight to this camera system to mean that I can use it for handheld work and I'm not getting a ton of micro jitter because this is still a relatively light cinema camera. Obviously we don't want to just be adding weight for the sake of it, so of course as well all of the weight that we are adding to the camera system obviously does need to be doing something or take you through all of the parts I've added onto it. Another thing is I do work a lot off of tripods, but I also do shoot handheld and a lot of the work that I do is relatively run and gun. And what that means is I needed a really, really good, reliable way to take this camera system off uh, a tripod and put it back on incredibly quickly not messing around with like the normal standard plates on the top of the tripod I wanted a decent quick release setup uh, and this camera system does do that a few of the parts in this video were supplied by small rig I've not been paid additionally to make this video uh, but I have been using small rig products for like years I absolutely love them and I genuinely think they are probably the best bang for buck best value camera rig system parts they're also super accessible and easy to get hold of, uh, so I have absolutely zero reservations in recommending them wholeheartedly. All right guys, so here we have the camera. This is the Canon C70. Uh, and in terms of an adapter, I am actually using the sort of standard basic EF to RF mount. Uh, this is the kind of, like I say, the standard version. I'll probably upgrade this at some point to the speed booster, but for now, uh, I'm kind of happy with this adapter. Then obviously we have the Canon C70 body itself. And underneath, this is the first small rig part. This is part of the small rig portable kit for the C70. It's basically instead of having a cable on your camera so you get a base plate a top plate and a top handle and we will of course be covering those off but the base plate I is just already screwed into the bottom of this camera here in terms of a lens obviously just keeping this fairly simple here a standard lens this is just a 24 to 70 f 2.8 uh, I use a whole bunch of different EF glass but just for the sake of this build that's the lens we're using so we can uh, just put this lens directly on the camera itself in terms of battery, like I said, one of the main advantages of uh, the C70 is that you don't have to use uh, big external battery packs if you don't want to. I'm using an off-brand BPA90. I think this is from a company called Hanel. Uh, I'll link it in the description. Absolutely amazing battery. This uh, is a large one, which works well on the rig because it adds a little bit extra weight. And this lasts for like a good four to five hours of filming. So a full day, no problem with two of these. I actually use a BPA30 and then a BPA60. That obviously just like normal slots directly into the back of the C70. And then I keep the standard right handle uh, grip on the C70. I just love the standard Canon grips. I think they fit my hands super well. Then the next part of the small rig build, this is the top plate that comes with the portable kit as well. Uh, just basically expanding the amount of mounting ports on the C70. So we'll go ahead and screw that directly into the hot shoe mount uh, or the cold shoe mount on uh, the C70. And as ever, whenever I do these build videos, I have my small rig multi-tool. This is just amazing little multi-tool, which uh, always comes with me on shoots. Never know when you're going to need Allen keys or screwdrivers. Okay, so once that's screwed on, I'm going to use the microphone attachment that I've got here. And this comes with the Sennheiser mic. We will just screw that into the uh, hot shoe on the left. Um, and that's where the microphone will sit uh, in a minute. The next main component of the small rig rig, it's their universal shoulder mount. Now I don't use this as a shoulder mounting system, but it is an absolutely brilliant 
uh, tripod quick release system basically means that I can just have uh, the base plate permanently set on my camera here and then I can connect this part to the C70 and then I have just this unbelievably efficient quick release system for the camera and it comes with the just massive added bonus of adding a lot of weight and stability to the camera and also and a few extra mounting points it's like an Arri rosette mounting point if i wanted to add a shoulder rig system and this is the part that actually screws on to uh, the tripod system that you can see how this would sit on a tripod and then just like that that slots its way in uh, and basically this is already looking like a much more solid rig. I actually love just using this setup obviously um, with that lower plate on a tripod. I use this setup for handheld filming all the time. It feels very, very sturdy and adds a lot of support and weight. And then like I said, this can very easily be quick released. Next up is the top handle. We have the top handle here. This again comes with the portable kit for uh, the C70. This just screws directly into the top of the uh, the top plate here. In terms of a mic, I'm using a Sennheiser MKE 600. Uh, it's absolutely brilliant mic, pretty affordable as well compared to the quality that it gives you. I think this is a compete with top for like uh, around $250, $300. I've got it for about £230 here in the UK. In terms of cable, I'm using a mini XLR to standard XLR for the microphone. This is an absolutely tiny one I found on Amazon. I'll link this down below. It's like perfect size for the rig setup that I've got. Um, like I said, this just goes and connects directly into the side of the C70. And this rig is starting to like really starting to look um, pretty nice and pretty clean here. It's got a microphone on it for really good scratch audio and then it's got the base plate and obviously the lens. There's a few uh, a few little extra things we need to screw in here. First of all is rails. If we're using a bigger lens I like to have a bit of additional support on uh, the lens. So I'm actually just going to screw those rails in and those, those go into the front of the, um, the tripod base plate or the quick release base plate. These are carbon fiber rails and these are three inch rails or potentially four inch rails. I'll link the correct length uh, down below in the description, but they're carbon fiber and super, super light. And then once we've got those rails installed, this can actually go on. This is a lens support system. This just screws onto the front of, uh, the, of these rails and has a customizable height. So we can basically, uh, for pretty much any lens, you can give it an additional lens support. Just take some of the load off the actual lens mount uh, and like I said, if you're using potentially like a 70 to 200 or something like that on here, you're definitely going to want a lens support because that really is uh, quite a lot of weight on your camera system or, or on the actual mount uh, itself. And you definitely don't want that to break. And that's that, just like that. That rig is actually now built pretty much fully functional. And you can see how now potentially that directly mounts to the top of a tripod. It's like super, super quick and easy. Uh, and this like comes off and uh, if I'm going between tripod shooting and handheld shooting, this is now just an absolute dream. Okay guys, that kind of wraps up the video. That is that, the rig build system on the C70. I hope it has been useful, helpful. All of the link parts will be down below in the description. Let me know if you have any questions and I'll catch you guys next time.